Hi everybody, today we're going to learn sketching of quadratic function. First and foremost, let us recap. The degree of any quadratic function of the form y is equal to ax squared plus bx plus c is 2. Why? We actually take a look at the highest power of this polynomial function itself. As you can see over here, it's of degree 2. Next, in any quadratic function, the shape of the curve is either a U-shape or an N-shape, otherwise known as a smiley face or a frowning face. Alright, where do we look at? We will always take a look at the coefficient of the square term. So in this case, if the coefficient, in this case which is A, is positive, it means that we will have a smiley face, otherwise known as a U-shape. The converse is true as well. If A is negative, in this case the square term is actually negative, we will have a frowning face, otherwise known as a N-shape. This is what you have done previously. So, let us move on. Any quadratic function can be expressed either as a factorized form or in completed the square form. And you have learned this previously as well. Alright? That's not the focus of today's lesson. What I need to do is just check whether for the following quadratic function, what kind of shape are you going to get? What you can do right now is to pause the video for two minutes and draw a rough sketch before you check your answer with mine. Very quickly, I'm just going to show you the shape. As you can see over here, this is a positive x squared. We will have a u-shape. This is a negative x squared. We will have a n-shape. This is a x squared inside the bracket term. But outside it, there is a negative 1. If you were to multiply negative 1 to x squared, you will have a negative x squared. So in this case, we will have an n-shape. Part D, x multiplied by x will give us a positive x squared. Your guess is as good as mine. Moving on. This is a negative 3x squared. So very obvious, we will have a n shape. Next, this is an x plus 1 squared. Multiply by a 2, you will have a 2x squared. U shape. This is obvious enough. U shape. X times X will give you X multiplied by a negative 1 outside, you get a negative X squared. So in other words, you will get a N shape. The last two examples, X plus 2 bracket square, you will get an X square. U shape. Last but not least, a negative X multiplied by X will give us a negative X squared. And shape. And we are done with page one. With this, we can move on to curve sketching itself. Thank you.